Wednesday, July 15th, and we just got a campsite at Pine City Campground over here right by Lake Mary. Showed up late yesterday, didn't find anything, everything was full. So we just stayed at a hotel for one night and uh, came back in the morning, found something while somebody was leaving, grabbed it, and it's a little late now, but we're gonna see if we can still get out there and get on something today. Some fish will be here till Sunday. Um, we have a couple friends coming up, so it should be a good trip. Hopefully we're going to get into some big fish. There should be a lot of float tubing this time. Three of us have float tubes, so it'll be good. Alright, here we go. Out at Lake Mimi. Trying to get Letty hooked on and then Josh is going to come out. Get a photo. There we go. That was on the ball head and the plastic worm from the All right. Oh yeah, those are good. Thanks, baby. Yeah. No. Yeah, I'm gonna let this fish go and keep fishing. There we go.
<laughs> Another one. He's going, he's going, there he goes. Sweet, and number two. Did you see them right there? Where? On that side? Nah. No. No? Well, I see a couple, but... Yeah. You know what? I haven't been seeing these. I just know they go back to their spots. Yeah. And from far, I cast out and then just slowly jig. This is my favorite lake right here. Yeah. I've all, every time I come up here, I always float to out here. But this is the best that it's ever been. Dude, this one's big. This one might be a seven. Mm -hmm. Alright, ready? I think I think I could do it right now. Ready? He's gonna go right now. Ready? Okay, fine. Oh, see you are. You can take off right away. like he wrapped up. Went under. He's, uh, he took me underneath. Oh, uh, he broke me. Yeah. Yeah, he wrapped me under the log and broke me. All right, well, we cannot find the fish anymore. Um, can't see them, don't know where they went. So we're probably gonna make our way out and go grab something to eat. Probably go check out another lake. So standing at the back of Lake George, we just scope it out from up here. <laughs> yeah, I could probably smell it. Oh, 
Whoa. <laughs> All right, time for me to get out of here. <laughs> Let this bear get its food. Shit. Where should it go? Probably this way. I got some already. Oh, damn. Yeah. No, don't. We're right into it. <laughs> right behind us. It came up. Right behind us back there. So we're out. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. It moved quick. This one bit on a micro minnow. That's a big one too. That was funny, dude. You called it. No, I don't want to go this way. Going to the right. Oh, yeah, he's right here. minnow. So here we go. This is a micro minnow. 
uh, 132nd ounce ball head actually bent the hook out it's way bent I would have lost them if I fought them longer that's on the eagle claw so you know the owners are stronger Plug. yep I just grabbed it because it was available hey Josh with the gnarly assist though how yeah he was like play by play you should have got he was that like, on video it's going for it slow down he's all set the hook he got it i was like oh shoot <laughs> that was so sick i didn't even feel it mm. it was right on the mm. lip yeah that's a beast good teamwork <laughs> um thank you <laughs> he's still so, he's strong. I'm trying. I know, but I mean I can't. Can you do Just leave him like that and take a picture of him in here. Okay. Just in case. Sorry, Josh, I'm taking a lot of pictures. I know, take your time. Just one more time. I got some good ones. Here. Perfect. Oh my gosh, this is good. <laughs> There he goes. Here we go, another one on the micro minnow. Yeah, that's a nice one. <laughs> out right there um, little minnow bent the hook again these hooks bend all the time but at least it gets the job done <laughs> there we go. There he goes. Sweet. Josh got on his first. What's that? It's a big one, huh? No, I think it is. It's got to be pretty good to pull drag like that. Oh, good. Yeah, that's a nice one. 
<laughs> Hell yeah. Pull drag like that. Oh, that's a big one. That's a really big one. Did you get it? Oh. Look at the log. Look at the log. This guy got one too? Nice. Two big ones. Good job, Josh. Thanks, man. Oh. I want to ram. Mm -hmm. Keep them. That's your first one, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want to say that's about. That might be a seven. Nice, he's got a big one too. Heck yeah. You have a stringer? No. <laughs> <sighs> oh, man. Dude, that was so much fun. That was dope. It was like pulling me around. Oh, oh man. I lost one over there too. Yeah, they go into the logs and it's over. Dude, that fish took off quick. Number three for me. <laughs> Josh is causing a commotion over here on the road. There's been like four cars here. Uh, Mamie. Oh, Mamie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So Josh, with his personal best, 7.6. We're going to cook it tonight. I also got a 7. A 7.2. We kept two fish, uh, released probably like four. 
So we're gonna go have some beers and um, probably fillet these fish or go fish some more and fillet them later. Figure it out soon. Bead headed nymph under an indicator. Oh, nice. This is a barbless hook. So this is our last state out here. So we're hitting Mimi again. It's been good for us. So I'm sitting at my fly rod. I'm gonna take an indicator. I'm gonna put it up the line and I'm gonna go with two midges below that. Not even too far off the surface. But um, my goal today is to get it on the fly and to get my girl on, on some fish also. So she's already out there. And uh, she's throwing a ball head right now with a worm. I'll be, and uh, I might switch it up for her with a mini jig or something, but we're gonna have to figure it out. So hopefully this is going. All right, finally, finally got one. This is on the nymph. It's a pretty nice one. Here we go. We get them away from the logs. I didn't even see him take it. I was talking to you, you and I felt the line just like, there's my new PB on the fly for sure. Not the biggest we've caught out here, but biggest on the fly for me. Finally, switched up so many different things too.
support SoCal Trout Cartel by visiting SoCalTroutCartel.com to purchase some merch. Visit CharacterLures.com and receive 20% off custom painted spoons by using code SCTC20.